Hello and welcome to Krisha Young TV. Um, today I'm going to be talking about foods to eat to taste good down there. I did this as a periscope um, a few months ago and I had over 900 live viewers and I got um, I think it was like 4,500 hearts on this Periscope. <laughs> it was my most watched ever and um, the most hearts I'd ever gotten from a Periscope. But it was really distracting. As you can imagine, there was a lot of maybe not so nice comments coming up because of the subject matter. Um, but this week is Valentine's week and I'm doing a whole sex week and I wanted to do something a little fun. Um, I also decided to kind of go a little topless and because I'm 40 years old and I'm finally in a point at a point where I feel proud of my body. I don't have body shame anymore um, and I really want to, I'm hoping that this is going to inspire other women um, because you can feel like this. I promise you can feel like this in your body. Um, you know, and, and I can help you get there. But today, we're going to talk about the non-scientifically proven foods that you can eat to taste good down there. So this is, you know, you got a hot date, Valentine's is coming up, um, and you just want to, uh, you know, tastes good down there. <laughs> and this applies for both men and women. Um, so pineapple is one. And the cool thing about pineapple is it also has a digestive enzyme in it called papain. So you're kind of getting like a one-two punch there um, with the uh, digestive enzyme and the fact that it's a fruit and it makes it taste good down there. And any kind of fruit, so like strawberries, apples, um, red grapes, cranberries, and apparently... I get, once again, according to the scientific research I did online of other women who made this claim, watermelon apparently tastes, um, makes your guy taste good, if you know what I mean. Um, and then there's this whole list of foods to avoid. Um, and of course, there's everything good for you, except maybe the beer, but like garlic, beer, coffee, asparagus, dairy, onions, um, meat, fish. Apparently, smoking um, turns your taste sour. Um, and the salt for vegetables so like cauliflower and and broccoli um now obviously as a whole food um advocate i'm not going to tell you not to eat these things because these are all extremely healthy for you um except for the beer um but oh and smoking of course <laughs> um but you know you got a hot date on friday night and you know you know you're gonna get down um maybe don't have so much like don't have a big like curry the night before or like a fish curry that have like most of those ingredients in it um the night before right so it's just like it's just that <laughs> so I hope you found this video fun and informative and that you'll share it and that you'll comment um and I'll spread the word that you know it's okay um, to enjoy sex and it's okay to enjoy your body as a woman. Um, and, uh, and it's okay, it's very okay to eat healthy foods because it has impact on pretty much everything. Um, I love to hear from my viewers. So if you have any comments or questions or anything like that, please comment below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.